Hey y'all, I know you're watching this video because you have no freaking idea where to put the transmission, automatic transmission and the differential fluid in your CVT, Subaru CVT transmission. It's a kind of a confusing mess, if you ask me. I'm gonna make this video quick and to the point. Okay, first we have the CVT transmission assembly, okay? This is the fill and the check plug for the CVT fluid, okay? It's not this, it's not this, it's not any of this stuff, it's this. It's on the left hand side of the vehicle, okay? Near the rear. This is the drain plug for the CVT transmission fluid okay this is the drain plug for the differential the front differential fluid uses gear oil not CVT oil nothing like that this is the check plug this is where you check the level of the differential not the CVT. And up here, on the right hand side of the vehicle, that is the differential fill plug. Not any of these, okay? Those are not for the differential, just this one only. Above the right hand side of the axle, okay? The right hand side, which is the in America, the driver's side. And this is not the drink or the fill plug for the differential. The left hand side is not. Do not put fluid in there. If you accidentally put fluid in here, it's gonna drain into the CVT transmission and you'll have to drop the pan and dump all the fluid out and put some new CVT fluid in there because you'll F up your transmission really bad. This, well, if you drain your differential and you try to fill it up here, you'll destroy your CVT and you will have a dry front differential and you'll F that up. Okay, so let's do this one more time. Um, to fill this, to do a service on this, you drain it here until it's out. You buy about four or five quarts of CVT fluid. You have to look it up, it's application specific. They're a little bit different every year uh, and different models. This is, this is more or less for the smaller size Subarus. And then you get the engine warmed up. You, you fill this up. Uh, and you warm up the engine to about 100 degrees, or the transmission, about 100 degrees. You can use a temperature gun if you want. It's supposed to be about 95 to 120 ish. Then you open the drain plug, the level plug, and you and you wait for it to trickle out. And then when it's when it's a small stream, it's not dumping out or a little droplets. That's what, then you put the cap back on and you're good to go. The differential. You use gear oil, drain it here. Uh, obviously you wanna fill it, or uh, remove the fill cap first, the fill uh, plug. But after you drain it, you fill it here. It's about one and a half quarts. Then if you wanna get it perfect, take this plug out to check the level of the differential, okay? spread this around because a lot of people don't know this and they F up their transmissions left and right. Please don't go to Jiffy Lube to do this. Get it done right. Go to a trusted mechanic that show them this video. Go to a Subaru dealer or do it yourself and uh, do it right. Have a nice day.